A news alert. Seal Berry, the interim athletic director at CU, the former women's basketball coach taking over from Mike Bone in what appears to be a contentious resignation. 7 News reporter Marshall Zellinger digging into Bone's contract, which may still pay out even though he quit. Mike, this is the 21-page agreement from 2011 between CU Regents and Mike Bone. It called for a salary of $297,000 a year, and this was going to be over five years. It also called for some incentives, such as graduation rates for athletes. That could have brought him another $100,000 a year. And there were some other incentives referred to as revenue-based incentives, such as increasing season ticket sales, $54,000 a year. At the bottom of this contract says if Bone were to leave voluntarily, like resigning there would be no more money but 7 news has learned there's a separation agreement being negotiated in eight years as athletic director mike bone ushered colorado into the pac-12 he also paid out more than six million bucks firing three football coaches the most recent john Embry in november seal berry an assistant ad and former cu women's basketball coach is taking over for bone on an interim basis seven news tonight obtaining an email bone wrote to his staff saying in part Regrettably, I am resigning as athletic director effective immediately. I believe it is best given the current circumstances. They want to go in a different direction, and that is their prerogative. Despite resigning, which according to his contract calls for no additional money to be paid, 7 News learning there is a separation agreement. Had CU fired Bone without cause, his contract allows up to $350,000 per year for the remaining three years on his deal, just more than one million bucks. We'll hear from both Bone and the CU Boulder Chancellor separately tomorrow. Bone also wrote in his email, which I've posted on my Facebook page, MZ7 News, he wanted to make it clear, I have not engaged in any impropriety, NCAA rule violations, university policy violation, or any immoral, dishonest, or other sort of misconduct. Reporting live, Marshall Zellinger, 7 News.